माई डियर फ्रेंड्स दिस इज विजेशन योर केमिस्ट्री टीचर टूडे आई हैव अपलोडेड ए वीडियो ऑन द टॉपिक एलिमेंट अंडर योर सेकेंड चैप्टर इज मेटर अराउंड द स्प्योर इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव क्लासिफाइड मेटर एज प्योर सब्सटांस एंड मिक्सचर प्योर सब्सटांस इज फर्दर क्लासिफाइड एज एलिमेंट एंड कंपाउंड टूडे वी नीड टू डिस्कस ऑन द टॉपिक फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल ऑन द टॉपिक एलिमेंट एलिमेंट्स आर एलिमेंट्स वी डिफाइन एज ए सब्सटांस विच कैन नाइदर बी ब्रॉकन डाउन इन टू सिंपलर सब्सटांसेस nor formed from two or more simpler substances by any non physical or chemical method is it clear means elements are the simplest substance which cannot be simplified further that means which cannot be divided into more simpler parts neither nor the elements can be formed from more simpler substances by any physical or chemical method known known to us now but all the substance in the universe are made of one or more elements all substances in the universe are made of one or more elements just like the english alphabet you know 26 letters are there in english alphabet which combine in different way to form a a lot of words a million of words likewise by the combination of few elements all substances all things around us including our body are made up of elements known to us is 180 there are about 118 elements are total number of non elements is 180 total number of total number of non confirmly no total number of confirmly non elements is 105 and out of these 92 are natural naturally 92 are natural elements rest all are made 
man made elements. Right? The elements, therefore, are uh, the elements are regarded as the building block of the universe because everything in the universe are made up of elements. Therefore, elements are regarded as the building blocks of the universe. If we can write here. Elements are regarded as the building block, building block of the universe, building block of the universe right nitrogen is an element which is the most abundant element in the atmosphere nitrogen in atmosphere Nitrogen, oxygen, carbon dioxide, water, vapor, some inert gases, these are present. But out of these all, nitrogen is the most abundant. The nitrogen, most abundant element. Most abundant element in the atmosphere. Oxygen. What is about oxygen? Oxygen is also the most abundant element, but not in the atmosphere, but in the Earth's crust. Earth's crust. It is considered, it is the most abundant. Most abundant element. Most abundant. Element. In the. Earth's crust. Earth's crust. On Earth's surface, in our surrounding on Earth's surface, we see sand, soil and rocks. Right? The surface on, in, in our surrounding on Earth, we see either in the form of sand, soil or mixture of sand and soil and rocks. The main constituent of sand, soil and rock are two elements. Oxygen along with silica. Sand, soil, and rocks sand soil and the rocks have two main constituents have two main 
constituent elements constituent elements oxygen and silica right now the elements known to us 118 elements they all these all elements occur at room temperature and the atmospheric pressure in all the three physical states of it means element elements some elements are solid some are liquid some are gases it means elements may be solid liquid elements are found in solid liquid or gaseous state right now see which elements are solid which are gases which are liquids gaseous in gaseous elements are 11 there are 11 elements known out of 118 there are 11 elements which are found in gaseous state at room temperature and they are hydrogen nitrogen oxygen chlorine chlorine so one two three four five and six inert elements inert gases and and inert gases are also called noble gases and the noble gases which are noble gases noble gases are helium neon argon krypton xenon and radon right so there are 11 gaseous element known to us and liquid element second one liquid elements there are two elements known to us which are found in liquid state at room temperature are mercury and bromine now third one is solid element solid elements are all other elements other than these 13 elements rest all are Solid. All other elements. All other elements are solid elements. Example: carbon, sulfur, phosphorus, sodium, potassium, zinc, silver, copper. gold etc right now uh, one thing i would like to describe here everything in the universe is made up of 
either one elements or more than one different elements including i have told in, including our body human body in our body our body is also a complex structure is made up of complex compounds formed by the combination of only few certain elements only few certain elements are there which combine together to form complex compounds and 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 that complex compounds constitute our whole body on the basis of the percentage composition of elements in our body if we if we take the percentage composition of elements which are present in our body so we can write percentage composition of elements in human body approx approximate percentage composition here i would like to describe for you human body contains maximum oxygen oxygen is present in human body in the form of different compounds 65% the data is approximate not accurate it varies man to man individually slightly it may vary oxygen 65% and carbon 18% see only few elements are there which constitute our whole body and to make you understand only few elements constitute this complex structure of our body कार ऑक्सीजन कार्बन हाइड्रोजन टेन परसेंट टेन परसेंट हाइड्रोजन थ्री परसेंट नाइट्रोजन थ्री परसेंट नाइट्रोजन Three percent nitrogen and uh, calcium is also an important constituent of our body because our skeleton, our bone is made up of our the, our bone is made up of a compound. Fifty-eight percent about fifty-eight percent of our bone. is a compound of calcium called calcium phosphate ca3 po4 whole 2 which is also called phosphorite calcium phosphate so the whole percentage composition if, if we take of calcium is about 2% now you add these percentages 65 18 to 18 to 20 65 85 10 how much 85 95 398 only 2% are there left 
तो वी ऑल अदर एलिमेंट्स फ्यू अदर एलिमेंट्स आर इन टू परसेंट ऑल अदर एलिमेंट्स टू परसेंट मेन कंस्टिट्यूएंट्स आर दीज अदर एलिमेंट्स इज इक्वल टू अबाउट टू परसेंट दिस इज ऑल अबाउट एलिमेंट्स नो इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो वी शेल डिस्कस द क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ एलिमेंट्स एज मेटल्स नॉन मेटल्स एंड मेटल वर्ड्स ओके थैंक यू